I was outside, I went shopping. Christmas shopping is a pain in the ass, but it's fine. We're here. We're gonna listen to some tunes and we're gonna rock out and have a good ass time. But to finish out the week of missed EPs, we are gonna do soul searching. And before you say anything like, that's not an EP, that's an album, it's too long, blah, blah, blah. I'm pretty sure an EP is anything considered under 30 minutes and it's at 28 minutes, so. Try to come for me. Yeah, I don't think I've heard anything actually from this EP, but with my little eyes by a collab that I'm actually excited for, y'all know I will listen to anything from Black. Literally anything. Anything. Did I make myself clear enough? Anything. Okay, little John. What is his name? John Bellion? To remind me of. Who am I listening to right now? Is this Post Malone? <laughs> like, it's kind of insane how much he has influenced a whole ass genre, a whole ass sound. I know Stan Twitter doesn't like Post Malone. Do we know why? I personally don't have a problem with him. I liked his last album. Y'all just fucking mean. <laughs> That's what it comes down to. Y'all just mean. But anyway, Humble Beginnings. I already like the sound of it. Of course, we'll go look at the lyrics in a second because with that title, like, there's no way there's not some great lyrics going on. And I know from the last album, like, he knows how to write. That sax is dirty. She's filthy. How dare he put that in this production? Now I'm here and I'm staying. It's basically a flex song, you know? Basically talking about how successful he has become on his own through hard work, through dedication, through just being talented. Hello, who would have thought? But the production's so somber. Why? Maybe because fame and the luxurious life style he may be living is not what it's all cracked up to be. You would think this is the future. Who is this? Center keep me going like a voice from above. Like he's centered. He's still here. He's still humble. A. Because money buys designer shit to wear over your scars. What did I say? Y'all, it is not all that it is cracked up to be. Who is this? Smoke, burn my lungs. Hey, hey, hey. He's from Michigan, right? I'm where I'm from where the lakes are great, like great Lake Michigan. Ha! <laughs> God, I can't speak English. <laughs> but I feel like this whole project is really gonna be about him kind of finding his place after shooting up to fame. Cause mine really, oh, she really did a number. Like she changed this guy's life forever. Yeah. yeah. Whose voice is this reminding me of? The weekend! Abel! That's who I'm thinking of! A little bit, right? Oh, I love the harmony in the back there. Oh, that's pretty. I like that. Oh, that's simple. Ooh. No, that's not the note. She was really short. She wasn't even a two minute song. <gasps> Here we go. Oh, she's another short one. Why are they all so short? Bitch. He better have a full feature. Y'all know I do not fuck with features. So for me to be like, it better be a full feature. It better be good because I'm excited for it. You know this is a good artist. If you are still sleeping on black, don't do that. I know I can't really say anything because it took me a minute to get on the train. But I'm here. Like, let me become the conductor. Let me ride the caboose. Okay, it was a decent feature. I don't know how I feel about the whole song, actually, like as a whole. Okay. Real quick, so I think it's really interesting because thinking of his last project, I do feel like it was a little bit more... Well, I can't even say that. I, mm, 
<laughs> I was thinking that his first project was a little bit more cohesive in the concept or in the storytelling than this one, but that's really not true because in the first half of the album or the EP, whatever the hell you want to call it, <laughs> we really were talking about self-growth in oneself. I thought that would be the whole EP, like the whole project. But now we're getting more into the love aspect and I was like, okay, so we're switching gears. But not really. Not only can you grow in yourself, but you can grow in relationships or grow out of relationships. No matter what the situation is, it's still a self growth. It's still a self discovery. Especially with this one being like, you know, I, I'm so not ready to move on that I want us to go back to bed. I want to essentially keep dreaming. I want to keep believing this reality that isn't actually happening. So let's finish out this song and then move on to the next one. So I want to see how it continues. Oh. In the rain, bitch. I'm a hoe for some rain. Get me wet in all different ways. I'm so sorry. Jesus fucking Christ. Okay, live forever. <laughs> Emo bop we all need. <laughs> you are sitting pretty with that hoodie on, on the makeup, on everything I want. Who's me? Do you really want to live, live forever? I guess what I'm saying is I, I fucking love you. I, I'm not going to say it. I'm not going to complain. I'm not going to bitch. I'm not going to moan because you already know what I'm going to say. And we're tired of it, I know. I just want to take a moment to pout. Okay, I'm good. I'm better. Saying, I guess what I'm saying is I'm, I'm fucking lonely. Are we bringing the... Okay, here's my only problem but i feel like there's something missing in this project that was present in the first one i can't really pinpoint what it is but there's something that i'm just not connecting with as much as i did on the other one i'm not saying it's not good like it is good it has great sounds it has fun lyrics i don't know there's just some kind of like little little cherry on top little spark that i'm missing but i don't know maybe the last few songs will wow me so let's keep listening don't focus back on me cut on me such a short feature like what was the point i love this part of the song i have like a weird dilemma with this one <laughs> oh he switched it up on me that time okay What'd you say? What'd you say, bitch? That's what I thought. Conversations with myself, me. Oh. Or if I have the strength to persevere. Little Bozzy, I'm living out our dreams. Mama cry every time we on the TV. Oh. Remember all your idols and the people that we love? I met him at a party, we was all doing drugs. We was all doing drugs. talking about my younger self. Guess what, boo? We made it. We did that. However, we also um, need Jesus. We're doing drugs. God have mercy on our soul. Just can't base your human value on them. Yep. At the end of the day, Word. they don't mean anything. Word. I'm just a lonely guy in a big home. Yep. Damn. Damn. Damn is right. Oh, and there goes the who am I? Oh my god, we found Jesus. To be something right now. The way he just sucked me right back into this project and it's the last song. This is cruel. Oh, but this one's so good. Overall, what I think of this project. Um, I don't really know what I think to be honest. I think this is one that I need to sit on and see how it 
gross or if I feel the same over time. I think the thing that was throwing me off was with his first project. I had such an immediate love for it and such a connection to it so fast. I guess I was expecting it with this one and that was my bad. I shouldn't have done that, but I don't know, we'll see. She has some gems in there. And I do like the concept of it because as a rising artist, you know, you go through so many different changes. You think you know what it's going to be like once you hit the big time, once you have a hit single, this, that, but it's always so different and reality isn't as picturesque as it may seem. So I'm happy that he could um, connect through his music and talk about it. I think that's important, so. So with all that being said, this is my current ranking of the album, my favorite to the one that maybe needs to grow on me just a little bit more. What are yours? Let me know in the comments down below. Of course, don't forget to like, subscribe, go check out my other channels for different type of content for me besides reactions. If you want to support your girl, merch in the description box below. I love you. Take care of yourself, y'all. Keep telling you, but I don't think you're doing it, so you better be doing it. Anyway, I love you, and I will see you in the next one.